All right, good day, welcome, loves, welcome to my channel. All right, <laughs> this is gonna get real. All right, I'm not, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna try to act like it's not. And I know a lot of people ain't gonna like what I have to say, but guess what? I wasn't put here to tell you what you want to hear. I was put here to tell you what you need to hear. All right, to keep it real. All right, if I hurt people's feelings, it stung, which means somewhere deep down within you, the energy that you're suppressing, you really know. It's your body screaming at you. All right, so the difference between mental illness and shadow work. All right, a lot of people don't comprehend that, you know, a lot of your anxiety, your depression, your mental instability, mental illnesses, a lot of that, it's just from suppressing lies, manipulation, deception, over, and especially if it continues year after year, decade after decade, why do you think you're feeling your chakras are all blocked? Because that's low vibe energy. That's low vibe shit. All right. So that's not replenishing your body. All right. That's blocking your body. That's blocking the flow of energy through your body. So, and <clears throat> what ends up happening is, you know, the extreme ones that want to try to like, and you know, it's like I tell people, all right, I'm not one that is for depression medication. I am so freaking anti de antidepressants, all right, because I feel like seriously, I've seen it done. I've done it myself. During transformations, you tough it out, you face it, and you rise above it. All right, there are things that cause anxiety and depression in your life, and a lot of times it's the way that you're living your life. All right, so it's like pills are just a band aid. All right, I don't care who wants to try to counter what I have to say. Some people might say, Oh, well, some people, you know, yeah, some people, and those people usually like need like a PCA or they need something like that because they literally cannot like, yeah. All right. There's more underlying there, but I'm talking about your typical depression, anxiety, mental illnesses, you know, shit like that. And I'll, like I said, a lot of that, all that really is, is people not wanting to do the work. The side effects of these medications not only destroy you mentally, all right, and blocks the flow, and it alters things that aren't in, in an unnatural way, and a lot of people get suicidal, I mean, that's the number one thing, oh, you may, if you experience suicidal thoughts and obsessive thinking, yeah, okay, nobody should be taking that garbage, it's pharmaceutical profiting, all right, I've told people, and I've seen it done, where you just come clean with all your shit, and you'll see it go away. A lot of that is all your lies, your deception, your whatever bad shit you've done in your, and not acknowledge. That's all it really is. A lot of this stuff can be fixed just by spending time out in nature on the regular and living honest. All right? Cleansing yourself, doing that real introspection. All right? I'm talking more than just goddamn two days or two weeks or, uh, no. Hermit shit takes like over six months to a year. All right? to really gain that freaking introspection it's that major self-reflecting and everybody wants to throw the word around and we live in a world where you can say you're this and that and there's always going to be that that crowd that follows and because they're just as fucked up <laughs> i don't care who likes this i really don't care this needs to be brought out because it's like yeah you're not doing the work you're not not doing the work all right so we have the eight yeah it keeps you fucking stuck it's the eight of swords yeah <laughs> oh god i suppose people get pity and attention right with their boohoo me and you know it's like a little crutch of oh boo feel sorry for me i don't want no motherfucking buddy feeling sorry for me hell no that is weak bitch man shit all right I don't, I don't want anyone to feel sorry for me, all right? No matter what, because everything happens the way it does for a reason, all right? Um, so, yeah, 
but yeah, it's the self-victimized. It's like it's somebody's doing this to their own selves. There's people out here in the collective that do it to their own damn self. It's a it's a boo-hoo me, pity me, pity me. Who the fuck wants to be pitied? What goddamn empress wants to be pitied? <laughs> Don't no empress want to be fucking pitied? And an empress ain't petty. Come on, it's time to rise up into your divine feminine people and your divine masculine, all right? And get out of this self-victimized, self-entrapped, self-imprisoned fucking mentality. You guys are stuck, literally, in a low-vibe, negative, vibrating, yeah, you just radiate bad frequency and vibration, yeah, because you're blocked off with the seven of wands here, all right? You reject shit. You reject it. And then you wonder why you get put out in the fucking cold got the star card yeah because you you don't want to do the healing work you reject the healing so spirits like screw you this is like part two to that other reading all right because i feel like spirit is like there's more there's more you know it's like a lot of people, if your life is like this in this lifetime, it's because you rejected and chose not to do the shadow work in your past life. So all that shit carried over into this lifetime. And then the next lifetime. And the next and next thing you know, yeah. I ain't even going to say it. So, yeah. I feel like somebody wants to be blocked off. They don't want to listen to their spirit guides, their spirit allies. Well, they don't give a fuck about you then. All right, that's just the way it goes. If you don't give a shit about what they say and want, why do they give a shit about what you want? When you can't even do the goddamn shit of unbinding yourself from this mental prison. Yeah, you sit in this three of sword energy. Oh, it's trauma from this. Trauma. And it's, an, it, it's a crutch. It's an excuse. Because if you're a grown-ass person and you're still using that as your... It's an excuse. You, it, a lot of people can overcome trauma. A lot of people do that have had a lot of terrible things happen to them because they focus on a positive mindset. They fo they want to break free. There's people out here that they don't want to break free because they don't get the attention. They don't get the boohoo me, the sob story, the martyr, the poor me. Oh, yeah, the ten of wands. All it does is creates burdens in your life all it does you're carrying so much shit <laughs> oh my god what is wrong with people like really and yeah like I've said I don't care who likes it I don't care I really don't I'm not a people pleaser I'm a realist all right I'm not here to be liked I'm here to do what we got here the five of swords and the death card this deceptive shit needs to stop because it's doing nothing for you in your life it's creating so many burdens so much bullshit I feel like it's an extreme narcissist that's what I'm really getting that needs to just shut the fuck up and move on get on your damn horse and go because I get really tired of doing these freaking readings because it's like, oh my God, like, how the hell do these people, like, if you have children, how the fuck do you raise your children not knowing this shit? How do you raise good, upstanding beings if you're in this fucking five of sword shit show? Yeah, I'm getting really fucking irritated with this energy. Like, you don't even know. You don't even know. We have here the page of cups. Yeah. Somebody here is a, they're a manipulator. Their head is in the fucking clouds. All right. They're not a sensitive being. They're a freaking basket case. All right. So yeah, the judgment card here. So yeah, it's like somebody here are, is so disconnected. Your head is in the clouds, but it's in a different direction than where you're being called here with the judgment. All right. Yeah, you're being called. I just saw the star again. You're being called to freaking do the work. Bad bitches do the work. Weak bitches don't. Yeah, the, I just saw the Wheel of Fortune shit. We got, well, we got the Five of Cups here. Though, with the Ten of Swords here, 
so yeah it's like somebody just constantly I feel like it's loss after loss I feel like the spirit guides are disappointed they abruptly just disappeared too I don't care what you regret doing you have to come clean with it but you're failing at that so let's get this wrapped up here let's get this wrapped up it's one thing I would never want to do is be a failure we have here yeah quit the fucking sneaky shit quit the deceiving the strategic planning all that shit the secret admiring whatever the hell you're doing stalking whatever you're doing you need to quit it and do that fucking hermit work all right that's what you need to focus on move along all right eight of cups move along walk away renew yourself all right last card and then i'm going to wrap this up here yeah your emotions are all screwed up the, the tower yep you need to go through some pretty fucking damaging shit but you created a lot of damage too i feel that's the only way you're going to escape it's the only way you're going to be able to yeah you're going to have to just tear your ass down we have here the five of wands I mean, there is just so much fighting, arguing, competing, so much stupid-ass bullshit. Like, Spirit, why the hell do I got to deal with this energy? Send it along to somebody else. Because, man, I know there's good and bad with everything. You're going to get good readings, bad readings, in-between readings. It all depends on the energy out there, right? And this time of year is a very depressing time of year for a lot of people. All right? Don't bother me, but that doesn't mean it don't bother other people. All right, so I'm just going to leave that there. Um, whoever, however many this is for, do the freaking work. All right? Be a woman. Pull your big girl panties up. Man, pull your big boy panty underwear up. And do the work. You'll really see things change for the better. All right? Do it for yourself and do it for your loved ones. All right? So you guys have a beautiful, uh, beautiful rest of your day, loves.